Welcome back. Joining us on set this morning, we're kicking up our heels with Andrea Hansen, president of the Kern Dance Alliance and dance instructor from Bakersfield Line Dancers, Joel Hoffman, here to talk about National Dance Day and how we can all have some fun from beginners to advanced dancers. Good morning, both of you. Thanks for joining us. Good morning, Maddie. Good morning. Thanks. This sounds like such a cool event. Have you ever done this before? No, this is our very first time. So National Dance Day is actually um, a product of Nigel Lithgow, who's best known for co-producing So You Think You Can Dance and Dancing with the Stars. And and he and his foundation, the Dizzy Feet Foundation, launched National Dance Day about 10 years ago. And so for 10 years, uh, the country has been hosting National Dance Day events all over. And this is Bakersfield and Kern County's first time to also have a celebration. And what's going on Saturday? 10 hours, 10 dance classes, $2 a class, $1 if you're a Kern Dance Alliance member. Wow. Classes from beginning to advance, ranging in style all day long. Come on out, have some fun, dance a little, and celebrate our national dance holiday. Every different kind of dance you can think of about, right? That's right. So we, <laughs> we start the day with Zumba. It fun. moves into contemporary jazz, hip-hop for children, hip-hop for adults. We've got um, country line dance class. That's where Joel got, comes in. Uh, yeah, we've got um, a dance and disability class. We've We've got a pole dance class uh, all over, and actually seven out of the ten classes require no experience at okay. all. Okay, Joel, why, why are you so passionate about dancing? You've been doing this for a long time. I'll tell you why. Uh, when I started dancing, it was an opportunity for me and my three daughters to do something together. So every week, Monday nights, we'd go to the Crystal Palace and just as daddy and daughters dance. And so, yeah, I, we still dance together to this day. It's so fun. That's fantastic. Yeah. So you will be teaching one of the dance classes. Um, would you encourage parents to bring their kids with them? Oh, absolutely. Uh, in fact, I, I love when I see in my dance classes kids because where do you see like seven and eight year olds having a blast with 70 year olds and everything Fantastic. in between it's incredible it brings everyone together yeah. and, and you know I love that a lot of these are geared for beginners because a lot of people out there are like oh I, I really can't dance but would probably like to know a few moves you know we're going into wedding season that's right you know and the classes are taught by 10 different dance teachers throughout the county so it's a great way for them to promote their dance studios their dance organizations and for also us to come together as a dance community and, and really celebrate the day so just Two dollars a class. Two dollars a class. Can't beat that. Why not? Why wouldn't you come on out? Absolutely. So here's the information on your screen. Again, National Dance Day is this Saturday. Um, this is happening at the KDA Dance Studio up at Garces Memorial High School, um, at 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. All of those classes. You can find more information at kerndance.org slash dance day. Um, so where exactly is is the studio? Just to help people. Yeah. Get right so if you've been to a football game up at Garces, uh -huh. you want to park in the football parking area and. And when you drive in, it'll be to the east side of the campus. East side of the campus. Yeah, but there'll be plenty of signage okay, and balloons. Great. It'll really be, feel like a party the moment you Fun. get onto campus, and you should be able to find it pretty quickly. Awesome. Andrew and Joel, thanks for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. Thank you. All right, we'll be right back after this.